My name is Renel Mackenzie Lau. I'm 19, and since I was born, <laughs> I've loved football. Football's my life. I was actually trying on clothes in the bathroom and suddenly I woke up and there were two paramedics standing over me and I had no idea what happened. I was so scared, just, I can't, it's hard to put into words. There were so many emotions just running through my head. I was thinking the worst and it was just, it was just a really sad, like depressing moment. I just felt like everything was ripped away from me. I just didn't feel like I could live a normal life. It's never good to um, bottle up all this, these thoughts and feelings, you know. You need someone there who's supporting you and, and that's when I was lucky enough to meet Alex. My name's Alex. Uh, I work for Young Epilepsy. I have been working for Young Epilepsy for about 10 years now. And essentially what I do is I work with young people from the ages of like 10 to 18. And I just provide a lot of uh, personal support for them. No one understood how I was feeling, but Alex did. And he showed me that I was not alone and there were so many young people with, with epilepsy. I mean, without Alex, I wouldn't have, wouldn't have been able to have the courage to do things like this and to, to speak out and face up to epilepsy. When I first met Renel, um, he was not in the best place. Um, I met with his whole family and clearly I think everyone had been um, a little bit sort of shaken by the diagnosis. It's, it's a shocking thing to go through and I think it's a shocking thing as a family to try and cope with. Epilepsy affects you in life, with medication, with how you're feeling, you know, you might not be able to go, go places that you, you, you once could. I just had to find the, find the strength just to pull myself out of it and, you know, I just wanted to show people that you can achieve your dreams. That's why I want to do, like, so well in my football. I flip my ep epilepsy into something positive, you know. I don't see it as a, as a burden. It's part of me. It's made me a better version of, um, of myself. It's definitely made me mentally stronger. I just want to show people that they're not alone in what they're facing. More people like me need to tell their story. <laughs>